Hello everyone, I'm Sarah Kairumbawa and I will teach you the lesson from mathematics in the modern world which is about the measure of relative position. For our learning objectives, the audience should be able to understand the lesson and be able to find the c-scores of the problem or question. But before that, let us go first to the formula. So, to find the c-score, the formula we will use is z is equals to x minus sample mean over s. It is interpreted as z is equals to value minus mean over standard deviation. So let us try to answer this question. A data set has a mean of 6.8 and a standard deviation of 1.9. Find the z-score for each of the following. So we will start first with the letter A. But before we solve it, we will analyze the questions first and determine the given values. For the letter A, the given value of the missing x is 6.2 and the z-score of it is negative 0.32. Maybe you were all wondering how I came up with that answer. So, for the next slide, I provided you an explained solution video on how I found the z-score for letter A. So what I did here is I copied the given values and the value that we will find. After that, I started at letter A and had the value of x, which is 6.2. You would just follow the formula, substitute first the given, Subtract these two and divide it to our standard deviation. And our first answer on our C-score for our letter A is negative 0.32. Let us now proceed to letter B. So the answer for that is 0.21. Next, we have the value of X in letter C which is 9. So we will give you guys 15 seconds to solve it on your own. Okay, time's up! So the answer for letter C is 1.16. I hope you guys are correct in trying this question. Next is letter D, having the value of X, which is 5. Again, I will give you 15 seconds to practice yourself in solving and finding the C-scores of the given question. Time's up! So what do you think the answer is? The answer for the letter D is negative 0.95. I hope you guys learned from our lesson today. But before we end this video, I will give you four steps to find the Z-score. So first is to remember the formula, which is Z is equals to value minus mean over standard deviation. Second, analyze the problem or question by writing all the given values. And third, once you're done writing down all the given values, write down the formula and substitute the available values. And lastly, subtract the mean from the value and divide it to the standard deviation. And after that, you're all done. And that is all for our today's video. I hope you learned a lot from me. Thank you. Bye-bye.